I'm going to help you answer the question, can tires really affect how my vehicle rides? Now I bought this Matrix used a couple of years ago for my wife and she loved the car. But she had one complaint. She said that it rode kind of rough. Now I've been married to her for 36 years and I know two things about my wife. One, she really doesn't complain all that much. And two, when she does complain, unfortunately for me, invariably, she's always right about what she's complaining about. Since it was a used car, I checked out the tires. The rims were all new and shiny. And they had these Kumo tires that had a whole bunch of tread. They were brand new, practically. So I thought, OK, I'll put struts. So I put new front struts and new back struts on the car. And then, not being a complainer, she said, oh, yeah, it rides a better, so we'll just live with that. But, as I found out later, she was just placating me. She said it still rode a little bit rough when I asked her years later. But, as good things often come out of bad things, she had a tire destroyed by an object in the road, and I had to get a new tire. And since tires are usually better to change in pairs, I decided to change the two front tires. So I went on the internet and did a little research about these Kumos that it came with. And this time I decided to be logical about tires, so I typed in Kumo Tire Review and see what the internet says about them. And what do I find? A bunch of reviews that say things like, I will never buy another car with these tires. Be aware everyone, these tires are dangerous. And I will never buy or lease another Hyundai as long as they come with Kumo tires. And even, I will never purchase this brand again. I don't care if they were free, I would not use them. So I figured, time to look for another brand of tires. And after doing a reasonable amount of research, I decided to check out BF Goodrich Advantage TA tires and review them. So I checked Amazon first just for a general view and people just tended to like them, said I purchased these, wasn't disappointed. They were excellent, well-priced tires. Then I went into a really deep analysis where people say, hey, they're not racing tires, but if you want tires that last a long time and ride well, they're pretty good tires. So I decided to try them out. And since my wife is an elementary school teacher, she's not driving 130 miles an hour. She drives the speed limit. If it's 30, she goes 30. If it's 75, she goes 75. So you don't need a really high speed rated tire for her. And here they are, mounted on a car. And now she says the car rides like a dream and it no longer skids when she takes off fast or when she brakes. Now with the old Kumo tires that used to be on it, it used to skid when you took off, skid when you brake, and rode really poorly, even though there were still tons of tread left on it. So the moral of the story is yes, tires can have a lot to do with how your car rides, how it handles, even how it brakes and accelerates. So with a little internet searching, who knows? You might be able to make your wife happy for the next 36 years just by buying a set of tires. And remember, if you've got any questions, just visit the Scotty Kilmer channel.